Hello everyone, I'm Joshua Ryder and welcome back to video three, how to easily create payment and sign up options within minutes by using value add on. Now, before I get into it and show you how to do it, I want to talk to you really quick about third party integration problems. You know, every other membership site out there integrates with third party uh, shopping carts and we do as well, but we're different because we also offer you a built in shopping cart, but there is problems with third party integrations. Number one, it takes extra time and money to set up a shopping cart in a merchant account to work with your membership site using other options. The fact is, is shopping cart services charge extra money just to use them and merchant accounts can often be pretty expensive. So what we did to simplify it is we gave you a built-in shopping cart and a pre-approved merchant account for every single membership site you create. So there is no extra time and there is no extra money involved in setting these things up. Number two is it wastes your customer support time because they have to log into multiple websites. When a user calls in or writes in and they want to cancel or they want to get a refund or they need changes done, typically you'd have to log into your shopping cart to cancel that user and then log into your membership site to make sure they get deactivated in there as well. And it just takes too much time and it's unnecessary with today's technology. Also, third party integrations can easily break because they rely on two separate teams of programmers and two different bases of code. You know, the fact is, is when you have a company that builds a product over here and then you have another company that builds a product over here, sometimes those integrations in between can break down and uh, that's a serious issue that you don't want to get involved in. So with Value Add-on, we built the shopping cart to work seamlessly with your account. And also, uh, that brings me to the last one, which Third-party integrations cannot allow for a seamless customer experience, and they cannot offer a built-in customer billing manager like Value Add-on. What makes Value Add-on different than anybody else is when customers buy from you, they can actually view a list of all their transactions within their own um, users area. They can see what they bought, when they bought. They can cancel their recurring subscriptions automatically. They can uh, send in a support request to refund, so they can do that. But more importantly, they can actually manage their own billing. If they want to update their credit cards, they can log into their Value Add-on membership site account, and they can update their credit cards. If they want to put a new credit card on file, they can do that as well. And other third-party integrations just don't allow for that seamless integration because, once again, they rely on two different code bases, and it just doesn't work like that unless you have a built-in shopping cart like we do with Value Add-on. So I want you to understand that Value Add-on is different because it is the only membership tool with a built-in shopping cart that allows you to do things like create new payment options on the fly. You can activate or deactivate payment options. Let's say you wanted to create a payment option and you only wanted to you only wanted that option to be available for a week, and then if anyone tried to use that same order link, uh, they couldn't do it. Well, with our simple deactivate button, you could deactivate a payment option, and then once it's deactivated, nobody else can use that same signup link. You can also manage your customer's billing information like uh, doing cancellations and refunding without leaving value add-on and that's huge. That saves you a lot of time and comp uh, complexity. You can log into your value add-on account. You can manage all your users' information like cancellations and refunds right within your own control panel without going anywhere else. No need to go to a third-party shopping cart provider to do that. You can view a list of all customer transactions. So let's say a customer writes into support, they have issues with uh, you know, one of their products they've bought. You can pull up that customer in the back end and view a list of every single product they've bought and it's easy to look at and easy to see. And once again, it's 100% built in, no integration required from you. We did all the integration for you. We custom coded this from the ground up to work seamlessly with your account. So with that said, let's go in and see a demo of how easy it is to create these payment options literally within seconds. Okay, so I'm logged into the back end of the membership site that we've been working with, and I'm on the payment options tab. And on this tab, we have a few different options. We have our default built-in shopping cart, which is provided by a company called Stripe. Stripe gives you pre-approved merchant accounts. And with our programmer's ability, we've tied Stripe into this platform to give you a built-in shopping cart and a pre-approved merchant account with them. We also integrate with our co-owner, jvzoo.com, very easily. So for this example, I'm going to show you how to use our built-in shopping cart. I've already enabled it. Uh, to enable it, um, if you don't have a Stripe account, basically what would happen is there's a button right here that you would click. It would have you fill out a two-minute application form. And once you press submit, you're automatically approved and it turns on the built-in shopping cart. And to save time and to save my, sens my sensitive information, I've went ahead and I bypassed that step uh, and I took the two minutes before this video to do that. 
and I've enabled the shopping cart. So it's really simple. So since we have that enabled, as you can see here, I'm gonna click on this link over here. This is gonna take us into our built-in shopping cart. Once again, this feature makes us different than anybody else out there, and it makes your life a whole lot simpler, trust me. So to create a new payment plan, all you have to do is click on this blue button that says create new plan. And when you're on this page, you just gotta fill out a simple form, and you have a few different options here. You can create a one-time charge. That is a charge that just happens one time. You can create weekly subscriptions. Those are charges that happen every week. Monthly subscriptions happen every month. Yearly subscription, uh, subscriptions happen every year. And you can also create free plans as well. You can also create trials. So you can do a weekly with a trial, a monthly with a trial, or a yearly with a trial. So let's go ahead and create some different types of plans. I'm gonna create a one-time charge. I'm going to call this um, one time charge and give it a description. Only cost you once. Okay, and let's give it a price. So, for this example, we're going to go ahead and we're going to give it a $97 price. Okay, done. It took me a few seconds and now I have my first payment plan. So, what happens is, is now that I've created this payment plan, if I click on Get Links, this gives me a unique payment link that I can send to people and they can use this link to pay, register for my, for my membership site and gain access to content. But let's not stop there. Let's go ahead and create a few more payment plans. For this example, I am going to do a monthly subscription. I'm gonna call this monthly subscription. There we go. Let's try to spell that correctly. Um, we'll say happens every month. And let's give this a price of $19.97. We'll hit create plan. Once again, a few seconds later, we have a second payment plan. So now we have two payment plans for our membership site. So we can give these links out and give certain people different options to pay. Let's go ahead and create one more. Let's do a free plan. We'll call this free sign up. Sign up for free. Here we go. So now we have a free sign up plan. Now, here's what's nice about this, and I'm gonna show you this tomorrow in tomorrow's video, but all of these plans right here integrate seamlessly with our built-in sales page creator. As we create our sales page using the built-in sales page creator, which is optional by the way, you can use a custom sales page, it's gonna use these payment plans that we've uh, created, and we can link those to our sales page with just a simple click. So there is no integrating, there is no copying and pasting links into our sales page, and you'll see that later. Uh, we didn't put in a, any APIs, we didn't sign up for a shopping cart, we're not paying any extra fees, and anybody can do this. As you can see, I just created three new payment plans within seconds, and it's really that easy. Also, let me show you some more features of this built-in shopping cart. If we had customers that were ordering and signing up, we could click on the uh, history tab right here, and we would see a complete list of all the customers, we could see what they paid, when they signed up. You could view customers from using the Stripe shopping cart that we're in right now. And if you've activated JVZoo, you would see all of their um, payments that have been made here as well. If you have any customers that are paying you active subscriptions, like a weekly, monthly, or a yearly subscription, you could see all of those listed here. You could see the, the active ones and the ones that have been canceled. And you could also manage their subscriptions here as well. If a customer calls in and they want to cancel their subscription, mm -hmm. uh, you can do that here for them. If you want to create coupon codes, you simply go here, you press create a coupon, and you can, you can create a very simple coupon code and give discounts. If you want to integrate with third-party email providers like GetResponse, Aweber, Infusionsoft, and others, you can do that here. And if you want to control some more settings, you can click on that tab as well. Uh, if we go back to the Plans tab, I mentioned this earlier on in this video, let's say you wanted to deactivate one of these plans, you would simply press the Deactivate button, and anyone with those links would no longer be able to sign up. So we would deactivate those. Any persons that signed up originally would get grandfathered in. Any people that any new people that tried to use those links after you deactivated it would no longer allow them to order. So that's how simple it is, and that's how clean and nice it is to have a built-in shopping cart built right in to your membership software. Once again, this saves you time because I don't have to leave my membership software admin area and go to a third-party provider and process cancellations and refunds and look up customers and really just make my life a lot harder. With this solution, we built everything into Value Add-on to give you the easiest and simplest way to manage a membership site and sell online courses and still give you the freedom to create different types of pricing plans, 
Uh, we do have some more advanced options where you can create membership levels and as you're creating new payment plans you can assign these payment plans to different membership levels in different areas of, of content to save you time I'm not going to do that right now but it is very simple as you've seen we've made value add on the simplest platform in the simplest way to uh, build and sell online content so with that said that is how you use the built-in shopping cart to create payment plans okay so before I end this video once again I just want to recap and tell you you know what just happened with the built-in shopping cart, it just created your registration pages. It just created your secure order form pages. It just created your customized thank you pages. It created your customer's billing manager, uh, manager pages. Like I said, customers can manage their own billing information. They can update their credit cards. They can view a list of their transactions. That was all created and done for you automatically. And the system automatically created your welcome emails with the user's login information. So all of this information you would normally have to create by hand or uh, customize on your own. But the value add-on, the shopping cart, just took care of all this for you. And you saw how simple it was. Anybody could do that. So that's it for this video. Stay tuned for tomorrow's video where I'll show you how to use the built-in sales page creator to create a stunning sales page within minutes for your new membership site.